hello everyone so I will show you a simple method how to start with contributing to projects so first of all you have to go to the original repository okay this is the original repository let me log into my personal account Oh, it is not necessary that you use this but yeah this is a two-factor authentication for protecting your account but initially you can skip this okay so let's go to one of the uh, repository from to where you want to contribute basically so uh, you have to fork this you have to fork this repository and then you have to clone the next step is to clone so copy this so this should be your ID remember that and the here also your ID so you have forked from the original repository so it is being shown here okay then you have to clone this to your local system okay maybe you can create a new directory or you can just clone uh, you will get the directory created iot dynamic test dashboard so let's go to this directory and check the branch name okay you can also do the same thing in uh, your vs code visual studio code you can just go here and uh, you can say clone from repository or open folder so i have already cloned let me do it for you it will ask for the directory where you want to basically uh, clone this repository so you can either create let's create on the desktop select repository location yes so I'm creating at a different location here so you can select any folder where you want to open it yes so this repository is being cloned then you can open a terminal and you are in this directory and readme directory so parallelly i am showing you on terminal lots also okay IoT dynamic dashboard so there are a uh, few commands so that uh, your code will be in sync basically so these commands are I'll tell you the commands basically okay so this is uh, you have forked and also you have cloned so you have to basically create a sync from the upstream branch upstream is uh, where uh, the original code was there and the origin where you have forked to your id so upstream and origin should be in sync so these commands will be required i will put this command in the comment section okay so Now let's go to the original directory. It is dynamic dashboard. 
yes this is the original directory so just copy this i have only one branch here master okay that is correct if main is there then select master out of that git remote add git remote add upstream so upstream is your original repository and then git fetch upstream so it will fetch from the original yes it is done and then git merge upstream so upstream is uh, your original from where you are uh, from uh, to where you are going to contribute the original repository so you have to merge this so master of the upstream and your master and then git rebase upstream master okay and then do again git status so it's on master now create your branch check out minus b gaurav new okay now now i will do my changes 